what's up guys and welcome back to another video and today you guys going to be watching some call of duty remastered gameplay you know um in quotations one of the greatest call of duties of all time everybody was so excited about this game and now this game is dead like nobody really cares about this game anymore but as a good youtuber as a good content creator i was like okay i know my fans love boots on the ground call of duty so for a background gameplay let's get some boots on the ground call of duty and i was just trying to have some fun i'm not the best sniper by the way i'm not by any means really good at sniping in call of duty anymore i used to be really good at sniping but yeah i had a quad feed i mean a freaking collat collat what it, there whatever you want to call it i don't know what the hell that called collat right yeah to one bullet two kills man that's probably the most impressive thing you guys are gonna see this whole video honestly and i also go on a seven kill streak with this like uh snap rifle this was my first game on call of duty 4 in like a month too so you guys better be impressed right there man i was trying so hard to get something nice for you guys but i couldn't because this game is crazy dude i don't understand how people can actually sit here and play call of duty 4 man this game drove me insane like in a, in a minute you guys are gonna see a little clip of me i'm gonna show you guys a perfect representation of what call of duty 4 is to me basically like how insane this game is and i just honestly don't understand how people can play this game and enjoy like this is gonna be the craziest thing you guys are gonna see i was dying like back to back to back i couldn't even take a breath man like watch this now guys it's about to start you know you guys see me just die i was like oh nothing too bad you know that's normal but after you guys are gonna finish watching this little piece of the video you guys gonna realize that how much pain I was going through. I'm pretty sure if you guys would have been in my position right now, what what what's happening to me right now? If that happened to you guys, I'm pretty sure you guys would have probably just put your controller down, turn off your PS4, and probably go outside on like a for a walk or something, man. Because I was going crazy with this thing, dude. I was like, there's no way I'm keep dying so many times. I was like, no way, this is not happening to me, man. This can't be real, but. It was real, dude. I was just dying back to back to back, man. This was just insane, dude. I mean, I honestly, like, I'm not, I'm being serious right now. I don't understand how people can play this game. I mean, maybe I'm, I just suck at snapping or I'm just, I'm just bad at boots on the ground Call of Duty. I don't know, man. Maybe they're just me over here and I'm complaining too much. Maybe you guys over here are pros. You guys hit every single shot and everything, you know. You guys are the Call of Duty professionals over here. But I mean, I'm, I'm not okay. And enough of talking about Call of Duty 4 right now. The topic of the video. Damn, I talked about this way too long, man. I was not, this is not supposed to be that long. But the topic of the video is Call of Duty World War 2 new kill streak, guys. And the nuke better be in this game, honestly, man. I'm looking forward to this game. And I'm really excited about this game. And nuke better be in this game. Sledgehammer made Advanced Warfare. And Advanced Warfare did have a new kill streak. It was like a DNA bomb, I think it was called, right? It was a DNA bomb, and I was really, like, I wish I played Advanced Warfare more, but unfortunately, I did not play this game as much, and I never got a D DNA bomb. I think a DNA bomb, right? Like a 30 kill streak or something? That, wasn't that what it was? And especially in World War II Call of Duty, like, since World War II, um, this Call of Duty is taking place in World War II, basically, they better have a nuke, man, because the United States dropped the first ever nuke, you guys already know Hiroshima on the Hiroshima dude. That was insane. Some uh true events, guys, based on true story. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but yeah, guys. And all, all the nuke stuff basically was going crazy during World War II. Everybody was getting stacked with nukes. Everybody was going crazy with this stuff. Man, the number of times I got interrupted during recording this video is insane. I don't think I've ever been interrupted this many times. When I'm trying to record a damn video, dude, I haven't locked my door and people still trying to break in, dude. Like, come on, man. No privacy for a knock bomb, dude. No privacy at all. But my bad, guys. I don't know. It's, this commentary is kind of random, even though I was trying to focus on one thing. But like I was saying, nukes were the crazy thing. Like, it was a new big, not new big thing, but it was like, come on, man. Whoever had a nuke was the most powerful country, which was the United States, America, dude, all the way. We had a whole bunch of nukes. We dropped nukes. We were going off with the nukes, man. We were dropping those 25 kill streaks all over the place, going flawless. You know, nobody can touch us. And that was crazy. But I'm really hoping World War uh, Sledgehammer is definitely gonna. I think it's getting like iconic, dude. If they're gonna bring a nuke, like, and you guys saw the Predator missile, the score streak, where like from the sky just falls down. I'm probably gonna put a clip of it in the video if I 
if I'm not lazy and I'll go download the whole trailer and just cut the little five second part out of it. I'll, I'll post it for you guys so you guys can see. And can you imagine like seeing like from that sky view and like having a nuke just drop and everybody on the enemy team and your teammates can see that animation like... I feel like that would be pretty badass. Just imagine, dude. You call that nuke in and everybody sees that little cutscene. Nobody can move. Nobody can do anything. But boom, everybody's just watching that cutscene like it's the movie, man. It's like end of the world, dude. But one thing is, I would like, to, like it to be the same way as it was in Infinite Warfare. If it was in TDM, I wanted to end the game. But if it's any other game mode, just let it keep going. You know, like in TDM, maybe they have that cutscene. Other game modes don't really care about it. Just have a little timer in the background or in the, in the down in the corner or something. I don't know. It was like a nuke incoming. I mean, or Moab or I don't know what they would call it. But I definitely want to see that thing come back. And let me know what you guys think about the idea. Do you guys think that's a good idea? Like for them to have like a little cutscene over there of that little bomb dropping only in TDM because you know how in Infinite Warfare and look at me, look at me going up the stairs, dude. What am I doing? Like I don't know these maps, guys. I'm legit like level 27. I was trying to go up the door. I'm like knocking. Does somebody open? Let me in. There's the war outside. I don't want to get shot. And this guy just killed me with the AK, dude. You just get melted in this game like so fast, dude. It's insane how fast you die in this game. I feel like you die fast in this faster in this game than any other Call of Duty. I don't know if there's any other Call of Duty that you f die faster. Like, you seriously see a person, and uh, with a blink of an eye, boop, you're done. It's like, what happened, man? I want to have fun. I want to run around. But no, dude, you can't really do that in here. But, okay, I'm getting off topic again. I'm sorry, guys. But, like I was saying, I really want to see that new comeback. I really want it to be, like, really, really, like, special looking. I want it to be something special because World War II was crazy with nukes and stuff and it would be pretty pretty nice if they like put a lot of effort into it maybe have a little cutscene like i said maybe at least for tdm game modes only other game modes whatever just have a little countdown let everybody know the knock bump is the best and he's dropping a nuke on your head freaking reenacting hiroshima no i'm kidding what the hell dude that's that's kind of messed up to say but i don't know guys that'll be for the video i really hope you enjoyed this was like a random commentary all over the place man let me know what you guys think about this and if you're excited about call of duty i know i am and yeah guys peace out